This is Patricio back for more Space Kim, and I really do not like the name of this. <laughs> yeah. Now, much like the previous one, the planning is what makes this difficult. How are you going to make plutonium? And what I'm going to be doing is to first note that plutonium, which is number... There we go. Number 4, 94. It can be made from mercury, which is 80. And silicon, which is somewhere around there, 14. Now, the mercury 80 can be made from 10 oxygens. And the silicon from 14 hydrogens. So they're roughly even. Though we're going to have twice as many hydrogens as we do oxygens. The other thing that will make this very, very annoying is the timing. Uh, from the these things and you will find out soon here is my first reactor what I've done was I went back one level and did the first reactor for it and then I modified it uh, so it'll be you might see a similar pattern but it does pretty much the same thing for the hydrogen and oxygen uh, without the fusion of course this is not needed it's just where it's where it was when I saved it and the one thing which I have done was I moved the hydrogen down one um, because usually I find it convenient to be in one of these four. So I just sink with red, have red take it out. Then blue takes out the hydrogen and then the oxygen. That's all there is to it. Here I have my second reactor. And it took quite a bit of work as you can see and it has the controls um, what sometimes I might want to take this hydrogen and make it to silicon for the later plutonium and after I get my two plutoniums uh, make my hydrogen bond so let me go ahead and show you I'm going to want this to initially be control A on and this will take a while so there it is trying to slowly make the silicon Although hydrogen has a longer track, uh, there's going to be two of them for one oxygen. Oh, ah, crap. <laughs> See, I'm going to leave that in because that is why this is so annoying. Because you got to get the timing right on. Yeah, whatever. There's another mistake. <laughs> This is what makes this puzzle so, so, so annoying. It really is a headache. Okay, come on, come on. Well, like I said before, uh, there's twice the amount of hydrogens, so this should finish first before the oxygen. And there it is. There's our silicon. So now I'm going to kick this off. You gotta get that timing perfect. I mean. <laughs> so here comes the silicon. Off it goes. Well, actually, there's quite a bit of time here, but where did I sink? Oh wait, was that part of sink or part of a? Well, there's a bond. So you gotta get the timing very, very precise. Or else you're gonna screw up. Well, that will be appropriate name considering what this uh, puzzle title is. But no, no. I want to rename it. There we go. My third reactor is very similar to the second one, so I just renamed it Jaiwook. And as you can see, I took out four sinks. But other than that, and um, changing to control B, it's exactly the same. So, let me go ahead and demonstrate it. So 
we are pretty much the same. And again, the timing has to be just right. Come on. Come on. There we go. No, that's not going to be it. Come on. Thank you. And there. Yes. That is what we want. And then it's just like the previous one. Except for that. <laughs> uh, I gotta add one bond to that. That's no problem. Okay, now let's try it again. Come on. Up, bond, bond, and out. Now you're happy? Now you're happy. Okay, time for the plutonium. The last reactor is not hard at all. You just pick up the two other atoms, fuse it to a plutonium, drop it out, and that's it. Now, it'll take a long time for it to get there. Uh, start it with uh, my two controls on. And then, as I speed this up, you'll notice that even though hydrogen has a longer track, it is going faster. So let me jump in here. And there's my silicon. So, wait for it to drop off. Then jump over here. And there it is. And now we have to wait for this one to get done. Come on. There we go. So, have to wait for it to come over here. And there is my first plutonium. So now, like I said, we have to wait <laughs> for my second plutonium to get done. Come on. I don't want to mess this up. So now we got my two silicons, which will become two plutoniums. This is now done. Jump back over here, then over here. Now we just have to wait for this. Uh, meanwhile, there's my first plutonium. Uh, wait for this. Oh, come on. One more. Okay, there it is. So now I can kick this one off. And now we should hopefully just wait for the oxygen to fill up and then we'll be done. Come on. Come on. There it goes. And ow. Hence <laughs> the title of the puzzle. <sighs> oh, I hated that. I just <laughs> Oh, it's this world. And we get a choice now. Yeah, I'm gonna show off this one first. Like a boss. Okay. There's some story. So what we have here, carbon and hydrogen, and look how much we have to do with only two bonds. <sighs> Consider this like a final exam for what you've learned so far before they even show you the final uh, symbol thing, tool you have down here. So how are we going to do this? Find out next time when I play Space Kim. This is Patricio saying bye. <laughs>